For today, we're going to start reviewing. We have our test this coming Friday, so we're going to review. There's going to be six questions on the test. Today, I'm going to do three questions. I'm going to do three more questions tomorrow. That's a, that's a review of the, the test. Looking at the first one, construct the line segment perpendicular to the segment given through the point given. So I want a segment that goes through that point and it crosses the other side at 90 degrees. What I'm going to do, I'm gonna open my compass, I'm gonna center it at the point, the point that is given, and I'm gonna make sure my segment, my pencil, once I make an arc, it, go, it crosses my segment given, it crosses it twice. So I'm looking at that. Like I said, all I wanted was to cross the other segment twice. Now, I'm going to even keep the same aperture on my compass. I'm going to go at one intersection. I'm going to center my compass there. And I'm going to do an arc on this side, on the, in this case, the left side of my segment. I'm going to center my compass at the other intersection. Make sure you don't center at the end of the segment. You center it at the intersection. And I'm going to make this arc on this side of the segment. So it should look like that. I'm just going to grab my ruler, connect that intersection with the point. All right, I'm going to connect that, this intersection with the point that was given. And I'm crossing it through the point at 90 degrees to the segment. So that's how we do that one. Now, on the, so you guys should be fine for the first six questions. Now, looking at question number seven, question number two in my case, construct the bisector of each angle. So for question seven through 10, I'm asking you guys to cut the angle in half. So I'm gonna grab my compass. It doesn't matter how much you open the compass, just as long as you center it at the vertex and make two arcs such that you're crossing both sides of the angle, right? So I just came, center it at the vertex and I'm crossing both sides of the angle. Now, I'm gonna keep the same aperture of the compass. In this case, let me center it at the bottom intersection. You guys see where I center it? And I'm gonna do an arc where I expect the middle of the angle to be. I'm gonna center my compass at the other intersection And I'm gonna make an arc where I expect the center to be. Now I'm just gonna connect that intersection with the vertex. Let's see. I'm gonna do this in blue and there. Basically I cut my angle in half. So just a little recap, what I did was center my compass at the vertex and I did these two arcs right across both sides. Now from each of the intersections, I made the arcs in the center of the angle connected to the vertex. So I cut the angle in half. So you guys should be fine with questions seven through 10. Now, looking at question number 11, construct the line segment through the given point parallel to the line segment. So I want a segment that goes through that point, but it's parallel to the other segment. To begin with, I'm gonna construct a segment that goes through the point and crosses the other segment. It doesn't matter what which angle, I'm just gonna cross them. Then I'm gonna grab my compass and I'm gonna measure the distance from the point to where I intersect the other segment. So you guys see I have the, the compass center at the point and my circle goes right where the given segment and what I the segment I just drew right where they intersect. Okay, so I measure that. Now that I have that, I'm gonna go from that intersection and I'm gonna make an arc that crosses my segment. 
I could even make an arc that crosses my point, but I don't need to. I'm just going to make an arc that crosses my segment. Now I'm going to center my compass there, and I'm going to draw an arc where I expect my parallel line to go through. Then I'm going to center my compass at the point, and I do that arc. Now to finish it, I'm just going to connect that intersection with my point, the segment given, and this blue segment are parallel. So that's all I do.